emergent vegetation. Now, emergent vegetation is grass you can see. It grows up to the surface. It's laying up in there. A lot of times, it's, we call it like Kissimmee grass, or, or it can be all kinds of vegetation that's on the surface so you can see it. Emerges out of the water. Now, my favorite technique for fishing emergent vegetation is punching, flipping a bait. And what is the favorite bait? Rage bug, Strike King Rage bug. Oh my goodness, have I caught some big tanks on that one. That is a tremendous bait. Now the reason we like smaller baits, so you see it's not big and bulky, reason we like smaller baits because it slides through the grass easy. In fact, I caught a 12 and a half on this one. This is the Rage Menace, another great punch and flipping bait. It goes through the vegetation easy, gets down, looks like a little crawfish, a little bait, they bite it, you jack them up. Now you're using this on 65 pound braid or 50 pound braid, big tungsten weight, get them out of the cover. That is my favorite way of fishing emergent vegetation. Now another thing you can do is the hack attack flipping jig. Now this is a great jig. A lot of times that slim profile is good, but they might want something that's a little bit more bulky. And I found where some real big fish will eat a jig a lot of times where they're not eating anything else. So I back it up with the jig. Now you have to use a heavy one. You know, we make this into a, an ounce, an ounce and a quarter, but the ounce seems to be the best in that flipping jig to get through that cover. If it's sparse cover or you only have you know, cover that's just not as thick, you can throw a half ounce or three eighths or something to let it settle down. But that flipping jig will get in the cover and get you some big ones. Tip it again. Hey, one of the best trailers, Menace and the Rage Bug are both great trailers on the back of that jig. Now my final one is if you have some and you want to crawl something over the top or through it, you got emergent vegetation like Kissimmee grass, you got holes and pockets and things like that. Man, I just love this bait. This is one of my favorite baits. It's the Rage Cut R Worm, and it's, this is the Magnum, so it's the big one. So I, I, make sure you take your little tag off here because that is to hold it steady. Now it'll swim, and that tail just swims. You can throw it in and swim it through over the grass blades, let it fall into a hole, drop it, put it on a Texas rig with like a, a quarter ounce weight, drop it in the hole, swim it through the grass, emergent vegetation, it's good. A lot of times it's reeds or something like that. This is a killer bait. So you've got all of it covered. You've got the punching, getting it in the heavy stuff. You've got the jig that you can punch through to get some big ones. And you've got a little bit lighter bait with the Rage Cut R. Try those in the emergent vegetation, the vegetation that you can see, target fishing, have fun, catch some fish. Man, I love these things. That's when it's good because you're dragging them out of that big heavy cover. Have fun. Catch some big ones.